The new patriotic party scheduled June 20, 2020 as the day for its nationwide primaries in areas where the party has certain members of parliament. In the Ashanti region, out of the 47 constituencies, the NPP has 44 members of parliament. During Saturday's polls, elections were held in 43 constituencies except the Kwadasu constituency where there was dispute over the voters' album. The election was rescheduled for 24 June 2020. The incumbent member of parliament, Samiu Kwajonyama, came up against the executive secretary of National Accreditation Board, Dr. Kinsley Nyakun, and the deputy CEO of the Middle Belt Development Authority, Vincent Frimpon Menu. Voting started at exactly 7 a.m. at the various polling centers amid heavy security presence. Speaking to City News shortly after the elections began, the chairman of the three-member committee that looked into issues that led to the postponement, Dennis Kwakwa, noted that the party was confident that the concerns of all aggrieved persons had been addressed. The election is not marred by any act of uh, chaos or violence. Everybody is here because we have all come to accept that the MPP is more important today. If you look on the street, you see that everybody is so much concerned. No agitation. The only thing that they are with today is for us to tell them that, yes, this is the person that the party has elected. On his part, the constituency chairman, Yaobanambwedi, indicated that in order to avert any form of chaos at the constituency, the party made arrangements for many security personnel to be deployed to the area. Uh, you can see it. We have 95 policemen for the 10 police stations, 35 soldiers for the same 10 police stations. And the soldiers say, oh, please, calm life. They are patrolling, not necessarily uh, the uh, voting centers. Maybe somebody is coming, one may decide not to allow him to come. If they see him, they will come and confront what's the problem. And then they sort it out. We've spoken to them at length. We said, you should comport yourself, go according to the rules of the easy. If you do that, there will be no problem. At the end of the polls, the executive secretary, of the National Accreditation Board, Dr. Kinsley Nyako, defeated the incumbent, Dr. Samuel Kwejonyama, and the deputy CEO of the Middle Belt Development Authority, Vincent Frimpon Menu. Speaking to the media after being declared winner, Dr. Kinsley Nyako pledged to ensure unity within the party at a constituency level. I'm somebody who is peace loving, and I'll make sure that the peace endures. Unity reigns in this constituency. The one other vision that I had was that I will be able to promote a policy that I term community-based development, where I will always seek the views, opinions and ideas of stakeholders in the constituency.